We're celebrating the world's greatest women in soccer right now with the Women's World Cup airing on Fox 36. Their dedication, passion, and sheer love for the game match that of a local girls team here, the Toledo Celtics, who have set some pretty high goals for themselves too. Coach Yachty, Toledo Celtics 2010's women's soccer team right behind us. And you have the privilege of leading these girls into championships, correct? Good. Oh, well, I do what I can. Sharpen up our first touch. Would you qualify them as one of the best in the area here? I would. I yeah. would say that, you know, our club brings a lot in terms of our competition level for soccer. I think these girls are a wonderful group. You know, we're one of the higher level regional clubs and be a part of this organization. It, it motivates a lot of players to push themselves to the next level to hopefully get collegiate and beyond that. They compete at a regional level. As a matter of fact, they just finished competing at the Erie Memorial Day Tournament where they played against teams from New York, Pennsylvania, Ohio. They did a wonderful job, actually. They made it to the finals. Unfortunately, they came up a little bit short at the end, right. but we're very proud of their performance. Okay, and we're prepping right now for the 2023 fall season. Correct. So what do you guys emphasize in your practice here? Our general philosophy is building both the player and the team. We tend to, to be a side that works the ball out in terms of soccer. We, a lot of short passes, a lot of simple passes, moving the ball quickly and efficiently, building towards goal. Now, what these girls bring to the field, how do these skill sets translate into the real world? For our organization, we do emphasize discipline and camaraderie, mm -hmm. as well as building cohesively as a team, which yeah. is why we build on short passes and working the ball out. Yeah. I, I firmly believe that we develop not only players, but we develop good personnel as well. Definitely leadership mm -hmm. is a big part of it. I'm very communicative, just saying, like, go get this ball, back up a little bit, different types of tips to help out. I love winning. I love how you feel after you win a game or how far you've come to win something. Playing soccer is one of my passions. What motivates you to be the best coach that you can be for these girls? You know, the motivation of a coach is very simple. It's to see, you know, what you can do to benefit the youth of the area. And I'm very proud to see that we have a lot of girls from the city of Toledo, a lot of girls from the outside of the city of Toledo, bringing them in, getting a whole cohesive group, and just building towards whatever we can do to help them get to the next level is, it's its own motivation. I'm excited to see what the future brings. I'd love to have a girl from Toledo at a very high level. One, two, three, I'm Emily, and this is Toledo Now.